All right, so in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a really easy link that you can send to your customers um, that will allow them to leave you a Google My Business review without having to search for your business in Google and click reviews and then click the five star and then leave a review. It's going to auto-populate the redirect to your Google My Business reviews area uh, making it very simple for you to send a simple link in like an email um, or you can tell people, hey, just go to, for example, mindsmorenocollective.com forward slash review and you can leave me a review there. It's very simple. So this is what I'm talking about. So if someone goes to morenocollective.com forward slash review or if I send this link to someone, to someone um, in an email, let's say, when they click on it, it's going to automatically redirect them and pop up the area that they can leave me a review. As simple as that. There's no searching in Google. There's no clicking on leave a review or anything. It just automatically pops up. Um, so I'm going to show you how to create that. It's pretty easy. Before we start, you will have to do this on a phone. You can't do this on a desktop. However, I'm going to show you how to do it on a desktop. Um, but remember, uh, you'll need to do this on your phone using the Google Chrome app. So jump onto your phone, download Google Chrome if you don't have it already, and then open a incognito window, which is just a private window. And we need to be in an incognito window because you don't want to be signed into Google when you try to get the Google link that we're going to uh, capture. So I have... Um, you know, my Google My Business pulled up here. So this is uh, just what it would look like if I was on a phone, right? So go ahead and type your business name in and your business Google My Business listing should pop up. Uh, scroll over until you see reviews and go ahead and click reviews. And then click this fifth star right here. So again, on your phone, this window will not pop up. It will just bring you to this blue page and this is exactly what we want. On your phone, copy the link at the top and send it to yourself in an email or via text message. Somehow you, can, you need to access this link um, on your computer because the next steps are gonna be on your computer. So once you have this link on your phone, like I said, email it to yourself jump onto your computer um, and then go to your WordPress uh, dashboard. Um, once you're in WordPress, you'll need to download and activate a plugin called Redirection. Um, if you're using Show It Tier 2, which is the basic blog, it's already pre-installed for you, so just make sure it's activated. If you are using Tier 3 and you can have custom plugins, and you don't already have it, uh, just go to add new and then download redirection. It's a free plugin. Once it's activated, go ahead and click settings. And then you'll want to click redirects at the top. So scroll to the very bottom. And this is where we're going to add the source URL and target URL. So the source URL is going to be forward slash review. Um, and then, or it could be leave a review, anything like that, that you want. I like it to be very simple. So source URLs, just forward slash review. So that means when someone goes to morenocollective.com forward slash review, they're going to be redirected to this target URL. So I'm going to paste that URL that I sent myself in an email, and then I'm going to click add redirect. And that's going to create that cool little redirect that we just saw. Um, two more things that you'll probably need to check is ignore case and ignore slash. That just makes sure that if someone goes to forward slash review forward slash, it will still work. Or if someone goes to forward slash review with like a capital R, it will still work as well. Um, so once you add that redirect, again, that's going to create uh, the the effect where someone goes to your website and clicks review, bam, it's going to pop up the window automatically without having to click around. 
So hopefully that's helped you. If you guys have any questions about creating that redirect, uh, please feel free to reach out and I'd love to help you um, however I can. And I will see you guys in the next lectures. All right, bye.